Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So in this video, we're gonna be going through Act 8.3.4. And you see the team I'm going in with? See who's very, very first on my team up there, Nick Fury. Let's look at the boosts, all right? So this first path, you can see it has the gold. That's usually an indication that Kabam considers that path the easiest because they don't put the big boy prizes there. But look at that blood drive. Whenever a skill attacker inflicts a bleed, okay, right there. Skill attacker inflicting a bleed, that's Nick Fury. Uh, they also inflict a non-stacking slow passive for 15 seconds that apparently should be able to um, prevent an evade. And I'm going to show you guys because I don't know what happened. I remember that I had some question about whether this was working properly. But I brought in Nick Fury because of that. Okay. And then I just threw on a boost because you see how many boosts I have in my overflow. And they keep expiring on me. All right, so first fight, all right, we got the bleed, and we have a slow, all right? So look at the slow. Every time I inflict a, a bleed, I have a slow up, right? All right, so we're good. Let's bait out this, okay? And he goes unstoppable. Okay, so he's not evading. We're good, we're good. Um, and I was sitting there going, wait, was the slow supposed to stop unstoppables as well? It stops the evade. I know that, but I couldn't remember when I was fighting. I'm like, okay, well, whatever. We're good. We don't have to worry about the evade. That's, that was my big thing. All right. The unstoppable, whatever. We can watch for that. We can uh, avoid it after, because that's that foot loose. Uh, so every time they throw a special, they go unstoppable. And I probably just read it wrong. And I was sitting here going, huh, they keep getting the uh, unstoppable up to their special. But the evade is what we don't want, because that is annoying. But as you see, that fight went pretty nice, smooth, and easy. So bring in your skill champions that bleed. If you have a Nick Fury, even a, a five-star Nick Fury, you don't have to have a six-star rank five Nick Fury like I do. Bring in your um, five-star Nick Fury. He'll do just fine, okay? Watch for the uh, unstoppable. I also brought in my Hitmonkey, who also puts on the bleeds. We're good with uh, Hit Monkey as well. Look at it, just getting smacked up. It's fun. It's fun. We do it every once in a while just to spice things up, right? Not because of the inputs or anything, just to spice up the fight. You know, who wants to see Nick Fury just go straight on in and not have any problems, you know, not get hit at all? Yeah, you want to see that? Nobody wants to see that, right? Anyway, so here we go. Fire off that special three. I usually don't use the skip button only because after certain things happen, you know, not like inputs and getting smacked up in the face, I usually want to relax a little bit. And so I use that special three time to collect myself. Okay. That's why you see me not using the skip button sometimes. And sometimes I am using the skip button because I want to get done quick. But it does give me a little bit of time to recover and and recuperate all right but as you can see we're still on the first life of nick fury so not too worried about it all right not too worried about it oh he caught me there though i was like getting a little too happy and was like oh yeah and then he caught me with his special one of all things when was the last time y'all got caught by diablo special one Special two, maybe, but the special one? I felt so embarrassed after that. I said, you know what? Maybe I should restart. <laughs> but then I said, nah, let's just move on. Show everybody all the pain. All right, so again, 
We've got blood drive. Now, see here? Now, look at that. Whenever this slow prevents an evade or unstoppable effect. That's why I came back in here to look at it again. I'm like, so it's supposed to, right? So I'm confused at this point because they're still getting their unstoppable after their specials, even when they have the slow on them. But I, I, I thought, you know, I said whenever it prevents it, right? So that means it was supposed to prevent it. Is it bugged? I don't know. I have no idea. There's the unstoppable and there's a slow. And it's stopping the evade, but it's not stopping the unstoppable. So leave a comment below and let me know, um, is this just me reading that wrong? It didn't imply that the unstoppable would be stopped you know, prevented by the slow that you get when you um, put a bleed on them with a, a skill attacker. But Nick Fury, still, still on his first life. I love my Nick Fury. I probably will ascend him. I will probably ascend my Nick Fury. Um, But we got to see what the uh, Cyber Weekend maybe even after the gifting event, because I really want to ascend um, uh, Weapon X, mainly because he's a trophy champ. I like Wolverine. So, yeah. But we'll see. Down goes Hella. I also see that uh, Nick Fury gets banned a lot in Battlegrounds, unless they have him on the team. Most of the time, people don't want to deal with that Nick Fury. He's annoying. I understand. I get it. All right. Now, we are over here. And I wanted to make sure, because I've done this before. Messed up. See? I'm looking over here, and I'm like, okay, wait, no, that's not the path I was on. Oh, no, that, that don't look like the path. Ah, yeah, there's blood drive. That's the path. And I know it... Basically, if you went through a certain lane, it stays. But I'd rather double check because apparently I, I don't I, I, I don't uh, see it quite right. So double check. Now, I thought about using Hitmonkey over here just because we've been using um, Nick Fury all this time. But then I was like, you know what? Nick Fury still hasn't uh, gotten his... Um, uh, second life going so i'm like all right and let me tell you i have gotten wrecked by hulk okay i've gotten wrecked by hulk because once he gets to like his 15 um furies if you're not careful he goes unstoppable if he's awakened and all that good stuff with a high sig and he stuns you like if he stunned me right there it, it'd be over with that stun lasts for freaking ever. All right, see, like right here, but he didn't get unstoppable. So I'm thinking at this point that the slow stops their unstoppables, but not the node unstoppable. So when they do the special, Footloose gives them an unstoppable that's not stopped by the, or prevented by the, um, slow, but their normal unstoppable effects, if they are to get them, if they have a slow on, it prevents those. Leave a comment. Let me know if that makes sense. Um, but that's what it's looking like to me. Maybe, um, you guys are like, oh, that's kind of how we read it too. That's fine. It takes me a bit. Um, but that just from here, either it was bugged or it works that way that the only unstoppables it prevents are the unstoppables that they get normally, you know, not from their specials, but their regular ones. Now, in this case, he got all these unstoppables and I'm like, not all of them were from Footloose. Shouldn't it have prevented some of them? 
but I, I don't know. So you guys let me know. And I still do not have a juggernaut above five. And I got that juggernaut years ago. He was, I believe, my first five star. I think. It's been so long, but I don't have him as a six star, don't have him as a seven star. And I do want him. In fact, um, Juggernaut, uh, if I get him as a seven star, I'll probably take him to rank two. Now, I usually counter Immortal Hulk with uh, Nick Fury, mainly because I don't have to deal with the second life. I do have my deep wounds, by the way, maxed out. Look at that. Look at that. And I usually end up taking him down before he gets enough of the uh, gamma charges to uh, get his second life, immortality. And Nick Fury is still rolling on his first life. Second life, this fight would have been over already. Look at this. Mmm. Boom, boom. Nope. And for a little bit of fun, let's hit him with a special three. So I do believe that Nick Fury needs to be awakened. I was not going to use him without awakening. But as you can see here, he's still pretty good, even if he wasn't awakened. His awakened ability doesn't give him more damage um, on his first life anyway. Uh, but that damage potential is crazy. And with deep wounds, look at this. Nick Fury, man. Beast mode. I think, I think that was still his first life, right? I can never tell from looking at it unless I, I keep track of it. And I know people are telling me, hey, you can look at the um, uh, persistent charge. I never remember what to do there. All right, we're down to the final boss. And I'm going to show you who I'm going to go in with. Uh, but here's who we're going to deal with. Hunter Sense. Inflicting the defender with a damaging debuff. Okay. All right. That's all I really needed to know. We've got Nick Fury for some damaging debuffs. We got um, Hit Monkey for some damaging debuffs. Uh, I think we also have uh, Lady Deathstrike, Diablo. They all do damaging debuffs. So I'm like, hmm, we could do this. All right. Now, I decided to change him out. I think it was because I would get a nice full heal. And it may have been because when I was doing this, I remembered that he was on his uh, second life. Um, but he did that whole path. So I can't be mad at him for that. And we're going in here with basically a full team, full health. You know she's going down, right? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Even though I switched uh, in, I wanted to play with uh, Lady Deathstrike here. And I'm, I was still upset that they decided to leave her as she is. Uh, I felt like she needed a little bit of a buff. Not much, but like some damage. She needed a damage buff, okay? But in any case, here we go. Um, I believe her ruptures are counted as uh, damaging debuffs. All right? <clears throat> and I'm looking at something that I do when I start the fight. I look at the health and I'm like, okay, we're good. All right. See how she heals up from that. But I didn't anticipate the damage over time. Look at the damage over time, y'all. That's what I messed up with. And I said, okay, we're done then. But I look at how much health is going down and I'm like, okay, she can do this fight. You know, it, it's a little bit slow, but we can do it. But 
I let her get hit thinking to heal up and she did heal up, but yeah, that, uh, what was it? Cold snap. I forgot that she does a cold snap. I don't really fight her that often. And so I completely forgot. So I'm like, okay, that's fine. We, we gave it a little try. Poor little lady death strike, but we've got our hit monkey. Get a hit monkey. Avenge Lady Deathstrike. Ba da da da. Da 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 da. Skadoosh. Oh, yeah. Now, I don't like her special, too. But you see, I'm blocking. And I said, ouch. What the heck? I'm sitting there like, what in the world was that? Now I'm sitting there going, oh, no. We can't wait. Get her. Get her. Yeah. We had to hit into her block because I was not surviving another blocked special. All right. Oh, my goodness. That was a close one. But anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Now, of course, I had other champs, so we were going to take her down regardless. But anyway, take care and you all have a blessed day.